What time is it? Um, if it was up to this, it would be my poops time. <laughs> <laughs> Which is so funny because Kara found this at Ross already for like $20 less. So either A, these didn't sell very well, so now they're being put in Ross's, but I really do want it. I would play it, but we don't want to get demonetized. So, but I'm surprised that this is already at Ross. So we're at Walmart right now which I don't like going to because there's a lot of people, but <laughs> I wanted to see if there was maybe some new dolls, plus I had to do an exchange and I needed to buy graham crackers. So, we're at Walmart. <laughs> um, okay, haven't seen my life stuff in forever and like, oh my God, look at these pajama pants. <gasps> They've got a lot of accessories. I love, okay, this chair, is just too cute. I love all the Hello Kitty stuff that they've been doing. And if you haven't seen, this is what the Hello Kitty My Life doll looks like. She's $35. Comes in pajamas. And I love that every year they do a new desk. Like my desk, I think, is from like three or four years ago. But this one is so cute because it comes with a fishbowl. All right. So they have a ton of like LOL stuff here. This, though, is now $36, just like it is at on Amazon, which is crazy that it's $50 here because you think they would have rolled back that price already. Um, did everyone buy Barbies? Um, everybody's been finding the new fashionistas and that's why I kind of was like, okay, while I'm here doing something, let me <laughs> check it out, but no new fashionistas. And then I've seen these, are these new? Cause I don't remember them being in this packaging. Hmm. Maybe we'll have better luck at Target finding some of the new stuff. Maybe, maybe the new packaging. Cause that's what I'm looking for. Oh yeah. The new Care Bears. Remember from Toy Fair? Yeah. Why does he look terrifying? <laughs> I think the shape of his head looks weird to me. They have bigger well, chins now. Oh, that's an interactive one. Oh, touch reactions and surprises. <laughs> I do like this. If this is just a purse, I would buy it. It needs to just be a purse by itself. But the Barbie section is very picked over. You want you want the grumpy bear? I'm feeling this one in the mornings. <laughs> that's pre-coffee zone moment, like before coffee. <laughs> ooh, 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 wait. Oh, there's Rainbow High. I was like, is there no Rainbow High at the store? There is Rainbow High at the store. Not a lot. And then some of the OMG dolls, but not a lot. <laughs> and then these have also went on sale too on Amazon for $10. $5? What is this? What is $5? LL Surprise Pets. <gasps> the bunny ones. We're back. Wait, which series of pet is this? I don't remember you. Ooh, oh, re-release. Huh, this is from the first wave, series three. Comment, are these good ones to get? I might have to get one of those for $5. I don't know. Uh, I know, that is so pretty. Ooh. I don't need it. It's heavier than I thought. But it's really cute. It's almost <laughs> the same shape as the <laughs> Nana -na Surprise one down here, I think. But I haven't bought that yet. I've been doing really, really good. I might have to get a re-release pet though. That's really cheap. They also had, I saw on their website, the hair vibes or hair goals one was on clearance for $7, but I don't see any here. So if I see some, I might try to pick one up. We'll see. Let me know if there's anything that you guys are seeing that are new, something that I'm missing out, something that I should be buying or looking at. Um, Failfix is releasing Failfix pets, but I have not bought any of those yet, or I have not seen them either actually now that I think about it. Yeah, no Barbie extra here either. Hmm. All right, Walmart's uh, disappointing today. Uh, look what we found. So they have on shelf DJ. She is so cute. These are so big and so, obviously that's not the right price. It's for the car. These are normally $40, but Target right now is doing $30 if you do in-store pickup. So do in-store pickup and save $10. She is so cute. But which one did we get though? Which one did I get? <gasps> da -da -da. I got Bon Bon, which is so cute. I don't see her on the shelf. So I will be doing a review on that this week. I might post the review before this video. We'll see what ends up happening. Um, let's see. Oh, they have Bella. They have Bella. Oh my gosh. I've been wanting to get another one of her because she's so pretty, but I'm like, okay, should I? Do I need it? I don't feel like I need it. I don't know. <laughs> but I really want a second one though. So bad. I don't know. We'll see. They might have some other new things that I don't have. And then these, they have more of those, which I really want the fair faucet so looking one is just too cute. They have more of them. Did I really get the only bonbon? I think. Oh no, they have more. Here she is to give you guys a better picture. So cute. I love the packaging on these. I like that you can actually see them and that you're unboxing to style them, which I think is a much better idea than having it all sealed up. 
packaging is cute. I love the strap on this. Each strap is customized for that doll. I'm happy with those. And they have an extra 10% off right now too on the app. Like they're basically just saying, please buy all of them. I love the boxes on these are just too adorable with the Zodiacs on it. Oh my gosh. Like, look at that, look at that Libra. I love that her earrings are the scales. Like, such good design on these. I cannot even emphasize on there. Uh, and I'm waiting for these. The teen ones are supposed to drop in the middle of this month. So, of course, I'm hunting for those now, but I don't think they're coming out for a little while. So, we'll have to wait and see on those. But they have a ton of Rainbow High, though, if anybody's needing any. And they have a ton of Bella at this location, too. No new fashionistas, unfortunately, here either. So maybe at another Walmart or Target, we'll get lucky and find it, but they don't have them here. I don't know why. Maybe they're just, I think Walmarts were getting them first from what I've been hearing. So we'll see. Ew, is that paint? Did someone do a mess back there? They're pushing the Series 2 hair goals. I feel like I never come to this area, but recently I've been in the mood for the baby surprise dolls. Is that a baby Dyson? Yeah. Oh my god, that's amazing. And it works. Wait, it actually vacuums? I think it does. It does not. It says with working suction. Uh, so they can play and clean. Put your kids to work. Precisely. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, but I've been recently in love with these. I don't know why. I don't know why. I love their faces. I don't know, it sucked me in. And I've been recently in love with this house. I love the coloring to it. So we'll see if I end up buying any of these. And these I've not been able to find anywhere. And now they have a whole box here. And I think this is wave one, right? Yeah, I don't know. I've recently been into the baby surprise. That one, not so much. But the big ones. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. On top of that, they're like, if you spend 50, get $10 off. I'm like, hello. Okay, I'll buy everything. You might as well tell me. Uh, there's too many things. Ooh, so the first hair goals is on sale for 12 that's not bad. And the present surprise ones are $9. So sales all around if you're missing some of these. Ooh, $4 for those. I don't see any of the fuzzy pets though that I bought. Hmm. Maybe I was lucky and my target was the only one that got it. <laughs> and then I've seen so many people open this deluxe box. It is really cute. I love that they're mixing so many different toys in one container. Like that's a really good idea. And then this area, which is basically just a giant surprise area. Like there's so many different things. We have everything from like awesome blossoms to pixies to, these are still some of my favorites. I, I really, really love the itty bitties. I totally recommend them. I think they're just so cute. But yeah, what is something on this side that maybe I'm missing or I haven't reviewed for you guys? And I don't know, maybe I'll end up buying something. I still haven't seen any of the toy surprise by Zuru anywhere. None of my stores have those. And I actually really, really want them because I've seen so many people do advent calendars with them. But I can't find any. Oh, uh, found them. I don't know if I should do a review of comparing the minis with the house that you can build with the tiny toys camper that you can build. I wasn't a fan of the tiny toys. Like I bought some and they're cute, but to me, not as good as the little minis. The minis are 10 times cuter. I love the little fuzziness to them. But yeah, I have a video of that coming out soon too. But yeah, so a lot of stuff at Target. I feel like Target has more LOL stuff and better deals than Walmart. So go to Target. All right, I'm back over in this area. I didn't realize they had little pets too. I don't know. Has it, do a lot of you have these? Because I know that I've seen people with the triplet sets, and I regret not getting those. I don't know. There's so many options right now. Oh, this area is really cute, though. I just, like, look, look, there's, like, an actual, like, like steam machine. Like, what is this? Oh, my gosh. This is supposed to be, like, a... I can't think of the name of the machine now. A pot. Instapot. There you go. It's supposed to be, like, an Instapot. Ah, oh, so silly. This little baby's cute, though. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know if I want to go down the baby route of dolls because once you fall down there, it's all downhill, right? Oh my gosh. $10? Oh, you're really cute though. Aw. See, now I want a baby doll. Oh no. Oh no, it's happening, you guys. Look at these. Oh, these have inset eyes. I don't know if I like that better or not. Hmm. Kind of like the inset eyes ones better, but these are just so cute. See, this would be my child. You'd be up in leopard. That's what you're going to be wearing. <laughs> So they have tons of the new Mermaid series. I have not given in and bought one of these because they're $15 and 
I don't know, maybe I will one day. I just haven't decided if I like them or not. Like, I really like that one that we're looking at right now, but I don't know. Maybe I'll ask for it for Christmas. My mom still is like, I don't know what to get you. You have so many dolls. I'm like, maybe I'll ask her for one of those. Um, in the collector area at Target, this is pretty cool. Well, this is a sneak preview from the movie. They haven't really shown That's anything. Crazy. Well, because the movie was supposed to have come out by now. I just like the packaging and the detailing to it. He looks really cool. Yeah. If you're not familiar, Target does have a collector's area, and they have tons of figures, NECA figures, uh, different brands from more of like an adult collector versus like, ooh, that unique face on there. But I love all the alien ones that they always have. Like, they're so detailed. I don't know. I'm, I'm a huge fan of this area just because... You get to see something that's a little different that you normally don't see, and they always have like little, oh my gosh, is that a Beer Juice plushie? Oh, these are just so cute. Oh, watch. Ooh, Nightmare on Elm Street 1, Nightmare on Elm Street 2, which I feel like Nightmare on Elm Street 2 doesn't get enough love. The, the Man of Your Dreams is back. Ugh, that's so funny. I should get this one to go with the Pennywise Monster High doll. They could be friends. I think you need him. Look how cute he is. Oh, look at that. Look at that little face. He's just like, eat me. Like, <laughs> it is adorable. Oh my gosh. That is just the cutest little plushie. <laughs> Vicious, but cute. <laughs> they have the Christmas Barbie with her blue eyeshadow and all. Oh my gosh. I don't know if I need her or not. Oh, do I need her? Oh, but see, I don't have the rest of the collection. That's why I'm trying not to buy this one. Cause I'm like, I don't have the rest. So I shouldn't get this one. In unrelated toy finds, this happens to be my favorite Christmas movie, and I've been looking for this cup everywhere. So if you're looking for this cup, super random, um, it's actually really, it's even cheaper here than Amazon, which is crazy because you think like Amazon's always so cheap. So guess what my Christmas cup is this year? <laughs> So make sure to stay tuned at the end of this video. I'm trying to do more pictures at the end of my videos, so that's what I'm gonna to try to do with this one. Um, only thing I really got was the big um, Bon Bon doll, just because that's the only thing I found that I really wanna review and really needed. Make sure to check out all my social media and we'll see if I go on another toy hunt before Christmas. Maybe? I guess this is my Christmas toy hunt. All right, bye guys.